Hello, YouTube. This is Tim, your friendly neighborhood bastard. Today, we're talking about The Fuzz. That's right. This is the Carl Martin The Fuzz pedal. And uh, this was so graciously lent me by my buddy, AJ. Thank you, AJ. Uh, this was really fun to mess around with. And this is, as it says, handmade in Denmark by East Sound Research. Um, and you'll notice something right away. It is actually wired into a, a, a mains plug. You, know, you have to plug it in. You can't use a 9 volt with this thing. I guess sorry for anybody that <laughs> doesn't plug their pedal board into something or doesn't have readily available electricity. Uh, so sorry, third world countries and whatnot. That's terrible. I'm going to go straight to hell. Anyway, without further ado, let's check some sounds out on this thing. I'll also play a little mini song for you later so you can hear how it sounds in a mix. Uh, I, as always, I am playing through my Chapman ML3 Modern. I'm going to run into the pedal and then into the beige channel of my 11 rack. Now, I don't know how old this thing is exactly, because like I said, it was borrowed. But I have noticed that the switch is a little bit dodgy. So if I have to press it more than once, I do apologize in advance. So uh, I've got the gain sort of uh, just right there on noon. Um, I set the level how it needs to be set for this patch. Let's check out how it sounds. Again, for reference. So pretty good sound right there. Uh, not a whole lot to it, as you can see from the controls. Backed off the middle slightly, increased the treble slightly. Um, so let's let's screw it all the way up, shall we? I'm gonna first play around with the gain control, then I'll play around with those waveguides so you can get a feel for how those sound. So you can hear how the, uh, how the high can really roll off the highs, and the deep waveguide can really thin things out when it's turned all the way up. And uh, so that's why I like it right there, kind of in the middle. <laughs> um, I mean, that seems to be the order of the day with a lot of these pedals, is that um, right in the middle seems about right, because the amp is going to be doing most of the equalization. Go figure. So just briefly, let's go over to the controls on this thing. You have your requisite level control. Then you have your waveguide, your deep and your high. That controls how messed up things sound. <laughs> uh, you've got the amount of gain there, and then you've got your bass, middle, and treble. Anyway, so uh, there's really not much more I can add to this. It's a great fuzz sound. Um, I guess we can scoop the mids, see how that sounds. <laughs> Sounds like crap, just as I thought. That's what happens when you scoop mids on a fuzz. All right, well, here's the little mini song uh, that I recorded with this. You can hear how it sounds in a mix. Left and right hard panned are the uh, two tracks with the fuzz. 
And then, of course, the bass was just run through the 11 rack as well into one of its bass models. And uh, Easy Drummer did the drums. So, yeah, check it out. Well, that does it for the fuzz it does one thing and it does it extremely well and guess what that is fuzz go figure it's aptly named well until next time i'm tim your friendly neighborhood bastard be excellent to each other and party on dudes